It's time, it's no, time live. for some Where's the Line? Oh, yeah, it's gonna, time. We need a theme today. We need a theme. I think we have a theme. I think maybe. Ladies and gentlemen, what's the theme? to you the one, the only Ross Jordan and Matt Hayes. Oh, my, am I singing too? Okay. Okay, maybe. Let's see. Let's hear it's it. It's time. It's time for oh, some. Where's the line? Yes, yeah, time. time. It's time for, for some. The line? Where's the line? It's time. It's time for where's the line? It's time. It's time again. Guys, I got him to sing. Yay! Yay! He's coming out the box. Yeah. Oh my God! You know what? It, it it cracked me up as I was thinking about, ladies and gentlemen. Hello. Hello, hello. How you doing? How it's you good doing? Good to be here. I've been a little under, but that happens. I'm sure you can even kind of still hear it in my voice that I'm not. Not fully there. Not fully there. I don't know, but um. It, it dawned on me that what happened was we watched a, a a retrospective on the dark side of the moon. Yeah. By Pink Floyd. Yeah. And I, I have literally often given credit to Pink. That's an inside joke. But anyway, <laughs> I, I've often given credit to Pink Floyd as one of the earliest philosophers in my life. Mm. That it, it, it somehow Pink Floyd manages to be the most, the most badass group ever to whine about what a pain in, in the ass it is to be middle-aged. <laughs> but it's true. I mean, yeah. uh, Dark Side of the Moon, which comes before the wall, okay, is just a masterpiece. And the four guys that did it were, are even willing to go, I, I don't yeah. know how we did that. We no, they, did they that. can explain oh, okay, it. Okay, they can explain it. The cool it. part is That's they're technical good. guys. They're That's science good. guys. They played with it. Good. But it, why? I like, I like, I like both. <laughs> I love I love the techie guys who can like explain how they created a I masterpiece. I like the other guys only if they're willing to say they don't know. Yes, only if you're willing to if you're if you're comfortable enough to say how I don't that, know. how the process actually happened, which is we crafted this piece and we were working at it and mm -hmm. it it was it took some time or we was just throwing it at the wall and 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 something stuck and it was it was really good. I, they that. The interesting thing is, it reminds me of our process. It's kind of there's a technically organic side. I don't know how else to yeah, explain it. Yeah, it's there's, a little bit of both because you're it's, trying it's, to do a thing. Well, but we think about ways in which it expresses itself out through the technical part. Yeah, like we're constantly talking about the ways in which you promote things or how you put it out there and what that means. And I mean, we have constant right. And we talk and we talk constantly about what to do with royalties if there were, were some. But um, <laughs> right. Well, one of the big things is every artist is worried about. Royalties. Do I own it then? Do I own it? Yeah. And I think my point of view at this point is. Yeah. Yeah. I that. I I, I literally am at the point of no sign it away and if they want to give it anything back that's fine. It's. Does that make? I, yeah. I know that doesn't help any because everything I've said prior. By the way, this is the money show, right? And this is the money shot. The Sorry. money shot. Money, money, you money, know what the, money. Never mind. You don't know what the money. It's a porn reference. You oh, jeez. Yeah, it's. Yeah, I know what it is. That's I, why I, I made I, it. Really, I remember what it I is made now. A gruesome face, like. <laughs> <laughs> vinegar strokes, my friends. Vinegar <laughs> strokes, I say. We're at the vinegar strokes. Well. We were talking the other night about an idea I had. I ran all the way through it, right. discussed how to monetize it, right. everything else, and then looked at you and said, We don't got no money, though. Like, no, no, no. That's not what okay. I, it was. I don't want it. The, I don't want it. Remember, it was the, yeah, you, there you was had the a long, cool way detailed of, idea yeah. on a mark, some piece, and you were yeah. like, Oh, yeah, that's perfect. And I was like, like yeah, yeah, that's a perfect, but, that's a perfect thing. I remember what it is now. It was the, it was the fish thing. Yes, it was. It, it was, was a the virtual fish thing. fish thing. Do you want to go? Do you want to get into it or? 
I, no, I think we got time. No, I don't want. I don't want to. No, I ain't yeah. giving. I'm not. I'll give that money away to okay. friends. Okay. You okay. Know, you know what I mean? Okay. I don't. I don't want it to be about me. Mm. People look at me and say, "Gosh, I can find all of this stuff, but I can't find you." Right. Okay. Right. I will say this. Do I have I've got the current friends and I have a backup account waiting if there needed to be a public account. If there needed to be a public account versus a a private account. That I've got an account with one T. Mm -hmm. That follows stuff. Actually, it's who co-hosts with you, actually. Oh, really? That's good. It's it's Matt Hayes with no face. Okay. Um, uh, But I believe in this. Right. And so what I need is to find a way to be comfortable. To be comfortable. That's that, everything. <laughs> um, well. Contentment is the goal of life, so to speak. When it comes to this piece, I'm very uncomfortable. Yeah. This is something. I haven't actively asked anybody for anything since the f- before the fall of last year. Mm. That I was receiving financial help um, from someone, and then they um, agreed to fund us for six months. And See, by fund, I meant fund me so that I could make sure the mortgage was paid and stuff. I have I have the problem of some of the some of the words that you use. I I bought into, and now it's hard for me to find ways to make money. That I don't. Oof, right, that I don't now right. view. Oh my as God! You're right because it's constant. Somehow, tell the story about the producer. Don't don't use any names. And and it's nothing against yeah, 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 yeah. it. I I, I so, get weird anytime there's money around so the music. So I I want to work. I want to work with this producer. Right. Um. And he relayed to me. Okay. Um. Any work that I do as far as working on music with people is like I have to receive some kind of monetary stuff. Um he gave me a price and I I I agreed to that price and I I told I told we we worked out a deal and stuff like and that got the I price off. down and everything. You went off, but it 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 demonstrated to me that you care more about the interaction. Yeah. Then I than wanted the money. I want to flip the script. I literally here's my problem with the money part. I want to flip the script that when I look at music in general, mm-hmm. I see this beautiful way people bring their stories and talk about their real self out publicly. There's a reason why this is interwoven yeah. with the idea of launching more stories, more interviews. It's that everybody brings their stories to us differently. And when I say, I'm interested in all of them. I'm not. I talk about fish stories, don't I? <laughs> Pretty much. Clyde, we see you, bro. Pretty much. But that. That how do you right. approach that? Now I have. Now I will say this. Anybody out there can steal this one. Mm-hmm. This one's free of charge. Mm-hmm. And there's not a lot on this current name. You can use the name and everything. If whatever I'm saying right now gets used by someone else for the following project, I fully release all rights and right. da 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 da. Whatever I'm saying. A different method of support. A D M O S. Right. We've gotten used to this getting together in Zoom meetings and getting together um, in support of each other. Right. That's what's happened with the pandemic. We've gotten much more comfortable. Shoot, there was even there was even uh, people were starting Zoom meetings to just watch movies together. Now let's say there's something you want to support, and it doesn't have to be monetary. Right. Let's say you've got somebody with an idea, and you've got friends. You're like, you guys got to hear this idea. Right. What you do is you have a Zoom room where you host. The person or the 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 project or the so you go hey this matters to me i'd like to introduce you to these people and the nice thing about that is it makes it so those people 
don't have to expose themselves at all. Because the big problem is today's day and age, what you would do normally is go, ooh, will you hook me up with your contacts? Right. That's not that's not kosher in my book. Right. That because then you're giving away like you have to. Hey, can you let me introducing get, people? Can you tell me how to meet Bill Murray? We'll, we'll use a. Yeah. You look at somebody that is in contact with Bill Murray, and I'd right. love to talk to Bill Murray. Right. I, because I re, he left guideposts along the way for everything I think. But anyways, I, so what I do is I this person in front of me knows Bill Murray. Mm -hmm. I have to go. Hey, well, will you connect me with him? Mm -hmm. Well, he can give me a connection. He probably has to call Bill first. Bill has to decide. You know, there has yeah. to be. Yeah, there has. There's now a little bit of yeah. This guy instead is in the position of going. You know what? I really know some people that I think I, I really believe in what you're doing. Right. So what I'd like to do is host you in a room. Right. That that, that the per, the host is in control, not the the. Not if person. somebody goes yeah. off the rails and you're supporting right. them, you go, whoa, and you look at your friends and go, whoa. Right. You can. But if you if it's something you believe in and what happens instead is a rich discourse in that room. Right. Whether or not it's a monetary thing, seeds have been planted and the world has changed. I think that so much of how people get ahead in life, so to speak, is introducing people to other people getting introduced to other people it ends by other up, people the being connected part is what matters whether or not we admit it yes and i don't mean the old boys network i mean in the sense that six degrees of kevin bacon is the best example <laughs> everybody laughs and because there's a game out called six degrees of kevin bacon and right. if you find you can take any star in hollywood and can you get to them in six degrees in other right. words this person knows this person knows that blah blah blah, blah. six degrees um six degrees <laughs> also an amazing movie with um what's the one with will smith it might be called six degrees of separation but anyways maybe um the point is we're closer than we realize but we don't communicate in a way that is mean i don't and i that's not fair i'm saying i i don't mean we i that how do we make it so what we're i've got friends i know i'm all over the place i apologize i've got a friend that runs something called a socrates cafe oh it's a big movement socrates cool. cafe so there's a book guy wrote a book called the socrates cafe okay shouts out to the book i haven't read it i apologize but the whole idea is creating communities where what you have is discourse right right so that right. what you do is actually discuss things discuss that, things and talk about things that, that's where real learning starts right that and especially if you bring together a group of people that are willing to be wrong mm. the most powerful thing you can be do for another person is not just blatantly agree with them right it's admit that one of the possibilities is you could be wrong you right. might you right but it opens your ears to the idea of somebody might you're taking in the information. Well, part of that is... You may learn more information about why you're right. A lot of that is making, like, not being attached to your suggestions or your your ideas. You know what? Not being attached to your ideas is the yeah. best way to be, I've found. I have an easier time... I have an easier... No, just... I have an easier time in general when I, I can... When you give I speeches. can give an idea... And just not be attached to it. And then it's safe. Yeah, because I don't care if it ends up being reality or not. Right? Yeah. That we we constantly... There's a Okay, I know it looks like maybe it's set up this way. The camera came after the setup. That Ross and I work like this. Mm -hmm. That Don't get me wrong, sometimes I'm over here, his head's down, but... Hey, you know what? He turns up. Listen to this. I know right. I'm not as good about that as I used to be. I apologize. <laughs> it's okay. No, because I, I love it. I What we dealt with in the last week was... My love language is responsibility. I know. How is this the money show? Yeah. But my love language is responsibility. Yeah. What I risk, the rut I fall into... Mm -hmm. Is 
responsibility can steal your joy if that's the if, if you forget why you're there. I can tell you how that still relates to money because your responsibility to the interaction or the person or the the organic nature of things right will not let you indulge in money or or ask for money or feel comfortable with that i think i think that might I be i would shave part my of head and is. wear a robe if they were willing to take me as a monk that sat here and talked right I basically live that life, but right. I'm not a member of some specific sect anywhere. Right. I fit most. I, you know, if you, if I'm like passing the tests, I mean, I, I can't get buried in a Jewish cemetery because I have tattoos. Mm. Um. Let me think. I, for Islam, I really shouldn't be a smoker. Right. You know. Um. For Buddhism, I pass most of those. So uh, it's it's your. It's funny because I feel like this is my path. It's funny I because I feel like I'm you're to some extent to some extent you're almost like deeply religious in my opinion. I would say I would say deeply religious but not in the sense that not in the normal not in the normal sense exactly. It's like it's, if Spock was trying to figure out religion and he came down to no over here there's a step by step. Yeah. This is a step by step. I'm not attached to that. I see the divinity in the universe and I see everybody trying to describe it. But well, it's I I I've, I've always been trying to figure out how could someone be irreligious and religious at the same time. It's ridiculous. But it's still it's still you can still be religious in your irreligiousness. <laughs> Irregardless. Irregardless, pretty much, pretty much. I'm just adding horn at the end. It just keeps going. I know it's an irritation. <laughs> <laughs> Better than an anal irrigation. But anyway. Oh, wow. <laughs> I don't oh, wow. I don't, it rhymed and suddenly there and was an enema. Su- suddenly. So on to the next subject. We on cleaned to the that next up. one, yeah. Well, that. And how, what do you do then? Mm. What do you do? I, I'm, I'm the prime I found financial. That, I found that engine. the one. We need, we need a CFO because the CEO isn't the, doing much on the money. The one thing that will work right. in my head is merch. Okay. And if I treat everything that I sell as merch, I can keep it separate from the connections. So if I so if so I if treat, you're selling a worldly thing, you can accept. Okay. Yeah, if I'm selling a worldly thing, I can I can at least in my head. No, I can I'm accept. I, I, I can accept that it's that it's not so much because I've been struggling. I've been struggling with how do I get my Beat Stars page together, but I also don't want to charge people. Every time I reach out to somebody, I feel bad because I want to. <laughs> I want to charge them, but I don't want to charge them. Well, and in my like, head, do you know how Beat Stars ought to work? How should Beat Stars work? You rate you you list what percentage you expect off the beat, and anybody could use it. Because man, I want my beat to live. Right. Do you follow me? Like right. No, I even head, think it, it, I even think the leases are the leases are limiting because what the leases are is you can only sell a certain number of copies. No, and no, no. Then I, f- flat after that, and if you make it blow, I just want my piece. Yeah. I, that's all. I. That's it. Yeah. That's it. Well, I'll say, I'll say I know the difficulty in that. I just, I really, I really hope that. I really hope that we're able to find no, listen, a better way to do it. Listen, if, that's all. if anybody's in contact with anyone that's bigger in the hip hop industry, this is really the way beats ought to go. That imagine a world where what you did was you put your beats into the world at a percentage rate and then you got to watch them grow and flourish. Can you imagine that if you're excited because your beat gets mm. passed around by the superstars instead of, oh, you can't be on my beat? Right. Uh, it, no, a cool beat's a cool beat. Well, it's, it's, it's like my yeah. twenty. It's our. It's like wanting to do theme song is a twenty-four hour song, just endless, endless, endless. Yeah. But each with new and in different languages, mm-hmm. and because in my head the concept of if you've got a good beat, I want my bros on my beat. Yeah. I don't care how long the beat's got to be, and I don't care how many bros I got. Right. 
Do you have theme song anywhere where we can play? Do it? I have theme song anywhere where we could play it? Do you, I, uh, okay, so not right this, on this second. Project. Anyways, the point is, I can play my part. The point is the money. Yeah. La so what do you, But what do you do? How do you, how I mean, do you? Yeah, the only thing I can think of that morally... How do you raise 20 grand and never ask anybody? The only thing I can possibly think of that morally frees me, my, like, lets me sleep at night, <laughs> is merch. That's the only thing I can think of. Like, and maybe even, maybe even, like, Patreon, but... That's a that's a, what I'm gonna go on Patreon and tell dirty stories or something. I, dude, I don't, I don't. You know what I mean? I mean, I don't want to put that much work into it. It well, it's in that specifically. I mean, well, I suppose. I don't know. I don't know. I thought about the idea of recording some audio books that you and I would record a book together. Right. You know that we could do Thailand or we could do prison or we could do. Mm. Uh, there, I got. You just pick a, a chapter pick a topic and, and or we'll, we'll, just we'll go. dig on it. And we'll do like multiple hours on it. Right. So then it, I don't know. You know, I, that when it comes to monetizing, mm. for some reason I'm okay with the idea of views. You're okay with the idea of views, okay. That in my head, views are this funny ridiculousness that corporate, globo, corporate, whatever has kind of built in. Right now, that the concept that somehow somebody can decide to watch me, right, and then some corporation will pay me. So in other words, my audience isn't getting taxed. Right. I feel like oh, okay. You feel like you can you can feel resolute with that. I get it. It's that I'm fine with. That's the one thing. That's the one thing that I'm like okay. I'm even weird on. I see where honest, that is. But. I see where that is, and I. I got to go a long way to do that. That's why I come up with merch in my head. No, no, I know. I understand because, the system. No, I'm, yeah. I'm aware that, I mean, well, yeah. okay, let's get everybody migrated to YouTube. Let's get everybody migrated to Spotify. Let's get everybody, and it's, neither of them pay you much. It's a whole thing. So if you could tell all your friends, and like, I don't know, 100,000, 2 million of them. I mean, just a couple. Yeah. And, I mean, YouTube's a 1,000 hours before monetizing. And our primary yep. viewership, <laughs> is, our primary viewership is organic, and it's where I it's want it. It's a thousand and hours it and a thousand subscribers as well. You have to have both. Yes. I thought it was one or the other. I think it's both. That that's, I, and you know what I realized with that, is the whole money, is in the shorts that they make a killing, because they play an ad between each of them, but they don't gotta pay nobody. Well, the real advertising is in the shorts. Um. Hell yeah. Yeah, it's. That's the that's what all the marketing people are saying is YouTube is how to get big on YouTube is clips and shorts. Um, we have that. Yeah. No. Well, uh, do you know how you suck them in? Mm -hmm. You guys how? got killer hooks. Right. You throw your hooks at them short, and you go follow mm -hmm. us to hear that. You, you know what I'm saying? The hooks right. are so strong. Right. That you could drop hooks or bars. That you could throw out some of them. You have bars that are so, st and you 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 nibble them. Right. You see what I'm saying? I get you, what you're saying. Uh, I really think we sh you know what, that I, I like there to be as much recording as possible in the studio because you never know. Is that too far away? Uh, a little bit. I, my knee's hurting, guys. I apologize. You never know when something happens. Yes, that's true. Uh, I... I try, See, and I try to talk about thing, money, and I can't. Does everybody thing, notice that we are talking about money? Have you heard? <laughs> it's okay. But it's, it's my reality. It's no, it's it's difficult. It's a difficult thing to talk about. So it's how does a nonprofit profit? Profit <laughs> exactly. But how I don't want a profit. Non See, and then that. But then I don't like, want a oh. profit. I want to start a nonprofit. That's the whole point. Okay. It's official. It's twenty five minute mark. I'm anxious enough to smoke a cigarette. Sorry, Mom. Okay. Okay. It's hard for me to talk about. It's hard for you to talk about money. I don't want anything to do with it. I don't I don't care about that. I think it's stupid that I'm supposed to. All right. You know, I, I get why people look at me and they're like, Well yeah, but and I'm like Yeah, I'm worried about it. Yeah, I'm thinking about it. Right. Yeah, I'm trying to fix it. You know? 
Of course I am. It's the ones that look at me like I'm not. That's frustrating. Well, it's or the ones that look at us like we don't work. I had I had I had a conversation last night where I I was talking to a family member and they were saying, "Hey, are you making any money at this?" And I was like, "That's a constant thought." <laughs> I've thought about that. I've it sounds about that. like more fun than this. <laughs> I know that that I know that that doesn't really bring much much comfort, but, <laughs> but you're working your ass off. But I'm off. working at it, you know. I'm I'm trying to make it. Well, and that's the. I'm trying to make this thing. We're profitable trying to build somehow. something different. Yeah. And and the worst part is no, no. I'm not trying to make it profitable. I'm trying well, to make it go. Not profitable. I know. I, just, I know. Right. We get into this. I don't care about I don't care about being rich. I've I've come to the conclusion that I don't care about being rich. Do I want to have a big house? Yeah. Yeah. Do I want to be able to live nice? Do I want a hundred acres? Yeah. I have an idea for a self sufficient farm. Yes. Absolute exactly. permaculture. But when I do that, grid, but, but when I connected. do that, guaranteed, I'm gonna Amish I'm tech. gonna go the cheapest route possible. Well, not cheapest. And then why is well no you'll, yes, you'll, yes why is this there you go the, there you, don't you buy go buy cheap you buy smart well my point is. After that, I just want to give it away. I want to. I want to get no... it out of my bank account as fast as possible. Like I not, love you, man. not just buying it hey, on can stupid I, can stuff. Can I go on just, record I... as saying, you know what? I know I have a disease, and I know it's <laughs> infectious, and I know that the one lesson the pandemic taught me, the one epiphany mm -hmm. that really affected me, was that if you wanted to change the world. You have to infect it. Mm. You can't tell people what to do. You have to just see them and talk to them. Right. If you woke up one day and you felt like you were supposed to save the world, mm. wouldn't it scare the living fuck out of you? If it haunted you for 25 years, if it haunted you endlessly like something you knew you were supposed to do and that you'd walked away, would you feel the heat of a world burning like you had not done something you I were supposed tell to? You, I can tell you that when I was when I was eight or nine, and my, my mom will probably be able to confirm this, when I was eight or nine, I would look at the houses that were empty on my block, and I would look at homeless people, and I would immediately think, why is this a thing? Why why is this a thing? Why why is this a disparity that's going on? I was 8 or 9 thinking about this. Right. Like you know what? I get what you're saying. And then we it, try to figure out why our kids at 8 or 9 are already running around with anxiety and fear and I and mean, I'm not talking Hey, for the record, this basement's in the burbs. You know what? I've got a kid that lives in the burbs. I know lots of kids in the burbs. And I know kids from the hood. Mm. And I see the same thing in their eyes from different angles and extremes. Mm. But everybody feels unseen. That was a bar. I'm going to write that down. That was a bar. It said, I've seen something from different angles and extremes, but everybody wants to be seen. Dun, dun, dun. But it's it, it, that's the breakthrough. That's what all of this is about. That's what... You know what, if you want to hyper-therapize me, you know what, no. I have never. I don't have a desire for money or fame. I have a desire to share my message and be understood, to be heard, to be seen. That for me, it was realizing at a moment when I could see the dire situation for my fellow humans what's the it's the spider-man one it's the one with um garfield it's that if you have something that can help people if you have something they that you know they need oh you're and, talking about the andrew garfield uh, and if you don't yeah, spider-man give it if you don't do it if you don't yeah it will haunt you. It will eat you it will, <laughs> alive. It, it's, it's you. You bear. Uh, so, imagine feeling that inside. Mm. Over this, right. over this very thing, over the thing that, going no. 
how do you get in the arena? Mm. How do you move into a place where you can be seen and, in fact, not be judged? Right. Not stand on some specific podium and go, these people. Mm. Not stand by any individual sect or group, even if some pieces from each resonate more. Right. You know, I take the hits from the Buddhists and the Christians. Right. And I'm okay with that. I'm better with that. Right. That when you look at the idea that liberals and Republicans get irritated with me in the United States. (laughs) I have this theory. I I call it the, the theory of Pisa. The theory of Pisa. So those of you that don't know, there's a tower in Pisa that leans. Mm -hmm. Well, and it was built by idiots. That's why it leans. (laughs) First architect screws it up. They fire him. A couple floors up. Second architect, he goes up a couple floors, tries to lops, tries to get it lean back the other way. They do stupid stuff all the way to the top. That's why it gets smaller and so it's not So basically even what they should have done is when the first guy messed it up, they should have tore it down and started over. Look at the way we've built all of our systems. Mm. Look at the way we are as humans and the way we treat each other. Mm. Realize that that's piled on crap, piled on old crap, so issues on top of old issues. That's the that's the struggle. Realize I... that as beautiful as the many forms of government we have are across the world, the reality is what we have found is that over time power is abused. Yes. And no matter what, no matter which of these many forms you choose, we've never achieved a point where we don't reward the asshole for being in charge. Right. We don't reward the asshole for taking the most from everybody. We don't reward that. The way we measure penises in our, our on our planet, is with our by size of wallet. Even if you're like, have a tiny little crooked member. And yeah. are a billionaire. That was wrong. That I, was I would I would wrong. love so that it was a Just low a blow. Just, it was a little there's wrong. There's a there's quite a few billionaires in the world though, so I think you're okay. I hope so. I hope there's more than one crooked think, penis I, I out there. I think there's 300 in in America or something. Oh, multiple crooked so penises. Yeah, Lots of crooked penises. Yeah, that probably that description probably fits a couple billionaires. You know. This is the money show. <laughs> um, for those of you that well, are now thinking you're watching the crooked penis show, you are not. <laughs> you are not. Um, well, So the hard part is, when I look at Pisa, what I look at is, and now we have, I don't know how many architects and engineers over the years that have tried to get it right. There's counterweights that's hollow. The whole nine. It's ridiculous. It's not even a real tower. But anyway. It's it's not even a real tower. (laughs) Anyways. When I look at Pisa, Uh I look at the best intentions of humans like me and you, mm-hmm. trying to fix what came before them. Yeah. But it's a little bit askew. Yeah. And so you try to get it right. It's, and then the next group comes along, and it's a little askew. The other, I, it, constant, I used to constantly struggle with how to solve each problem when I was a kid. And what I constantly would find is that all of my thoughts were connected to each other. Because... Because in order are. to fix this problem, you have to fix this problem. You, which, which has to be fixing this problem before this problem. And it, it, it all, it, right. it all went into a circle where I was like, I was so, con- I got to a point where I was so confused with with which problems needed to be solved, how, that I was just like, you know what, I'm not gonna solve any of these. I'm gonna this just is chill. The money show with Studio I'm gonna just 586 chill. B. No. <laughs> I'm gonna just. Can you tell it's hard for either of us to stay on topic when the topic is money? Well, Can it's you an tell? interesting thing. And I take full blame because Ross wanted a don't lot of money take, when he got here. Don't take full blame. No, I do because when you first got here, you were ready to sell everything. Don't take full blame because some of those thoughts were mine. I just forgot. Some, some of the thoughts that you had were younger Ross probably would have been giving the same speech to because, older no, Ross. I'm telling you. Because here's, I'm you're telling right. You. Do you yeah. know why? Because the crazy thing is, 
this isn't a new thought. This is the thoughts that are there if I throw the crap off. Mm, right. This is what if you go back you to foundation and think else. about this. Exactly. Instead of going, this is the way it is. Right. What if your brain's open to, I don't know. Right. It's, I can't, I can't charge someone to speak to me. I, that's weird. I, right. That's a bit weird. I thought about if, dear Lord, people really wanted to raise money for me to come somewhere and talk. And it was like a donation. I would accept donations for coming right. to talk somewhere. That feels I, even that feels. But even that do, feels a bit odd. I would you have know? to go. To, you know, like yeah. maybe they'd have to pay for my travel. Other than that, if there isn't any donations, that's fine. Right. Or I don't know. Something you know, like, like I, I, that. It's that's. Do you know that that's how the Dalai Lama travels? How does he travel? He he travels with uh, doing speaking engagements. Well, they donate the money for him to travel. Oh, okay. And then the people there. There, there are donation boxes for Tibet and stuff right. while he's speaking, but he doesn't. Right. He's not just because he doesn't care. No, he, sh <laughs> he shares because he has yeah. something to share. Exactly. And that's what we're building here. That's what we talk about when we're talking about other people's stories. That mm -hmm. I believe, whether it's the Dalai Lama or the Pope, or Joe the Barber, or Husan first, <laughs> or Mohammed, or but the, I think all of us have that. I don't think anybody has some special hold on it. When I look at us, it's like watching caterpillars that have built cages that they don't know how to get out of. Mm. It's like watching people cover themselves in armor to protect themselves from a harsh world. And I just, I, I want them to go struggle, break out, you're a butterfly. But you have no knowledge of that. I always picture a caterpillar and the idea that, can you imagine locking yourself in a cave, that you, a cage that you've made of yourself, okay? Made of your own design. Right. And when you go in, you're what you know. Mm. You're a caterpillar. Okay. What would be going through your head as your body is literally physically changing? Growing wings that you don't even know are wings because you've never experienced the idea, the thought of flight before. Mm -hmm. Never. That's how I see us. I see us not knowing we're butterflies. I see us trapped in cages of our own making. And when we see our changes, we're afraid to show them, even though it's our wings. Mm. We hide who we are and the beauty of it. Mm. The, the diversity of our expression makes us beautiful, makes us who we are, defines the beauty of our species. Right. You know, I'm a science guy. Do when not I, the science guy. No, when I Sorry. look around, I see wasted potential. I see the greatest asset available to humanity, seven and a half billion ways of looking at anything. But what if you don't teach some of them? What if you don't feed some of them? What if you just kill some of them? Mm. For me, that's a loss. It's not that... What if the people that have given us amazing strides in research had been born somewhere where school was not an option right i'm not saying they wouldn't have excelled at whatever they did right but i'm telling you that we as a species are who pays the cost of being mean to each other of not being there for each other of not seeing each other as brothers of literally living in a society globally, globally, right. based on how much can, can you take from, you. from someone else. Yeah. I, I, I can't do it. Sorry, I'm done taking. Mm. I'm done taking. If anybody wants to make donations, if you feel like what we're doing is meaningful. If you have old equipment, if you have 
computers. If you, you got some anymore. time and you want to message us. If you got us. time and want to talk. <laughs> yeah. If you want it, Les, I love you, brother. I know I haven't talked in a minute. I had a rough couple of days. Um, that that's just as meaningful to us. And I know that makes it so that there isn't a bunch of money raised. Right. And I know that the fact that I always give the disclaimer of the most valuable thing any human being can give another is their time. Is their time. Yep. It's why when I look at you and say, put your music out raw, producers will reach out to you that believe in you and want to work with you, and they won't want to charge you. Mm. Not because I'm opposed to that existing, but because I think we need to create a different way of doing this. Right. A different method of support. Right. Make it so that artists aren't beggars. Mm. That nonprofits aren't begging. Throw a party for them globally. Whenever you can. Mm -hmm. Literally. You it, the resources are out there. Right. And I'm not this here goes the disclaimer. And I'm not talking about doing it for me. Right. I'm talking about make it a thing. I'm talking about Support the things you believe in by going, hey, have you met my friends? And I am telling you from my experience here, because it's really good to be here, mm. that your mind will be blown by what happens next. Because it's blown my mind. That's what we're doing. Mm -hmm. You know what? That is what we're doing. We talk to real people. Mm -hmm. about real things and we say hey have you met our friends and our friends say hey have you met our friends and that's how you end up with people like anthem <laughs> you know what we we have need money to post ads all over the world that's how we end up grant with came MZZ from a friend from of Bosnia. a friend right huh i said grant came from a friend of a friend right grant's a friend of a friend where we go exactly and I have a guy that just reached out to me today to just chat. Right. Beautiful guy from Nepal, currently living in UAE. He's mm -hmm. a zookeeper. I'm excited. I want to see pictures. Right. I, there isn't something I want. I'm not going, hey, wait a minute. He's in UAE. That's the richest country in the world. Do you right. know any princes? You're not, in, you're not analyzing who knows who and what. Now and I have to debate in my stuff. head whether or not I'm willing to sell Ross to a prince to keep the studio going. Oh, no. No. That is no. Well, in the world of which Bad one of us Matt. can pull off the dress, it ain't me. Fuck <laughs> you. A different method of support. Make it a thing. No, go, I think I go, think that go should go be out a thing. We should And people have Zoom rooms, they have Facebook rooms. We you should can do look this into right that. now anywhere for anything you believe in. Mm. You know what? You got somebody going, Man, I believe in what they're doing. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set up a space where we can sit and talk. Right. And the wild thing is Minus Sprint's current billing or T-Mobile or whoever it is that right. two hundred dollars. That's Memorial Day was two hundred bucks, bud. And I don't even know how they figured out the money because I'm telling you, we didn't spend. I we hit WhatsApp. We oh, I'm, I'm gonna yeah, I'm gonna we're, we have we're to gonna, do some study. We're gonna see some stuff. Our VoIP was not VoIPy enough. Voice over IP. Voice over IP. But it was worth every penny that yeah, I don't it have was. because. Dude, it that kept me going through May. <laughs> it stood for what we were doing. I mean, it stands for what we are doing. Kenya. Mm. California. Australia. London. Every person we talk to keeps the Vienna, studio Ohio. going. It keeps the it keeps the dream alive. Bosnia. Keep going. Keep going. I'm trying, man. I'm doing stuff like so Bosnia music. No, Iggy, then Bosnia. Iggy, I am sorry. I always do that. Iggy's got some great pictures out right now. So back to Columbus, Ohio. Mm -hmm. Out to Bosnia. No, not Bosnia. Czech, it was Czech Republic. No, he's in Slovakia. Slovakia. Oh, Bosnia. Slovakia. Yeah. No, MZZ I always and, confuse it for... MZZ I always Bosnia confuse it. and yeah. Thomas is in... Thomas is in... Slovakia. Slovakia, though. I think he's yes. in the UK again. Okay. Um, Right? Okay. <laughs> and the, the music show, we talked to people from all over and people came in right. and we began 
that if you want to go see the birth of the, the way the music shows are coming that's it that's us thinking about it mm -hmm. publicly you know mm -hmm. in a way that's <gasps> I forgot Tony 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 Williams on the harp yep oh my god New York uh, New York City that man and then you Buddha Josh Garrison yeah Sarah yeah came down and gave us everything she was thinking of. I mean it's an yeah this space opened people's up. We're a can opener. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. And it's, it's funny. We, we see a lot of push me, pull me. People open up a bunch, and then they, they kind of get scared and push back. That, too. We, it's it's a thing suddenly, you see in you people. Follow that? It's a thing you see in people. It's sometimes, sometimes people are comfortable with – sometimes people have never had a chance to really express themselves, and they get uncomfortable with it. And other times they're comfortable with it or they, they've just been looking for the outlet. Um, People are amazed that somebody wants to hear them. I was. I yeah. Maybe that's what I'm trying to share. Just the idea that somebody was listening blows me away. Right. And I don't mean um, – Well, you're always amazed. We're always amazed that people want to talk to us. Yeah, it hits me, and then, like it was almost. I I did the push me pull me. It amazed me Memorial, every time. Memorial Day sunk me hard, and it's like every what? every time any person texts me, and and they're like, yeah, I'm down, blah 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 blah, blah. and I'm like, ah, right? I'm like, oh, oh, oh snap, they're down. Wait, okay, so we got to do the thing. We got to do the thing. Okay, okay, <sighs> we could do the thing. Let's do it. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> so in I gotta the end. get back money it's a gas yep. you know what i i wrote i think it's in the first book somewhere i could be wrong it might just be in a journal somewhere there's a lot of notebooks around me um the hardest part of deciding this system doesn't work mm. is how much of this system you need to fight it <laughs> how much of the system are you willing to to use <laughs> well the, to to take down the system if you and, feel and that way, way you know? about people taking stuff from each other and support so but my opt but that's why i come with something admos a different method of support a mm -hmm. real thing a real thing yeah that it allows people to not have you know what i get it but don't overthink it keep support. it simple stupid believe in the things you believe in keep it simple stupid i personally believe in Josh Garrison. I do too. Dun dun dun. <laughs> I love you, Josh. <laughs> Is he the only one watching? That's he funny. The only one. He, but he commented. <laughs> love him, man. He's dope. I think I go ahead to be watching because it came up with 19 shares. It's already been shared oh, okay. 19 times.